Hey everybody, how are you? I hope you're doing great today. This design, wow, it's like, wow, let me see. Oh, my glasses are there, but this design, it's amazing. I think this is a masterpiece. Yep. <laughs> it's because one thing I was about to give up and I made before this type of plants, you know, carnivore plants. Uh, that never it was for a you know, specific character. So this one is a specific character. What is the name of that flower or that plant in the Super Mario world? The one that eats. Yeah. So that was kind of my um, two pictures pretty much. And I'm trying to, you know, figure out how to make a lot of balloons that look similar. And I want that, you know, type of idea. Because there is another one that is coming this way and then you see more this way. But I want it this way and then the... <laughs> I don't like But you get it, right? So, working and working. First attempt. Ba -da -ba -ba. What is this, right? It's like I was trying and then this. Ah, closer. But then I was like, and this is the fun and interesting part. The first thing when I saw those pictures, I was thinking of my quick links. Yes, using round balloons. That's the way. But I was thinking, hmm, let's try first with other balloons, 260s, uh, 160. But it is a good idea sometimes to listen to yourself <laughs> because that was the whole point. I'm going to throw this, throw that. I need to pop lots of, you know, attempts that I'm not there really. This one too. It was one, but you know, the one that is better. It's already on my playlist of Mario designs. So Super Mario, Mario Designs, Super Mario Character, something like that. So pay attention because there is a better tutorial of this one, better design. I'm gonna show you the main thing. Um, so now you don't have to make the whole, you know, pipe where the carnival flower is coming out, but I was thinking, why not? Because after all, that's gonna be the easiest part. The easiest is, will be that. I'm gonna show you and look. Ta -ta -ta. Look how awesome design! Another one that I feel so proud. I love it. It's so cool, right? You can use it for balloon decor. Now look at my beautiful, perfect polka dots. What is that? Well, now finally I'm using my labels, labels from the Amazon. Um, you can find it on my Amazon wish list. Go in the description. There's a, these ones are really cool and you can use it for many things like eyeballs and there is in different colors, but this size is the one inch and works perfect for this. So now I don't have to use Sharpie. So the cool part about this design, there is no Sharpie time, no Sharpie time for this design. Yeah. So now it's a tricky one. It's a new technique, which is really cool. You will learn a really cool technique that is going to help you for many other things. Open your creativity because right now you're learning a technique for a specific character but it doesn't have to be only for this character okay it can be for many things so this is the moment to realize that even if you are watching this tutorial for a specific character even if you think i'm not gonna make this never well you never know like i having a mario a super mario birthday party because that movie is coming so Let's see what are basic things. Well, you can always change sizes. This can be uh, 160. Now, but this is already a big. We are talking about two quick links here. And so better, I, you know, in order to what is physics, you know, it's better a 260 here to hold the flower. Uh, so this is the pipe. <laughs> That's it. Now let's do this. Are you ready? Okay, be patient. Don't give up. If you don't have quick links, it is possible using the five inch rounds and then using the technique of the racing beam. Uh, the thing for the quick links is gonna totally save you time. That's what it is, save you time. Let's just start, it. I love it. I even make this yellow and you will say, what is that? Well, those are the teeth, ang, ang, ang. teeth, because it's a carnivore's plant, so. <laughs> but it's a cute way because it's balloon. So that's my representation of teeth. Okay, look, anybody who sees this, if you go to a, uh, what is, Mario Party, for sure, they're gonna say yes. And especially if you start making other characters like this one. So it's like, wow, yeah, wow. <laughs> and then if you make the other one, the uh, Boomba, uh, or, and then if you make uh, the little mushroom, the Tots, and if you make Super Mario and, then, and Luigi, totally it's all about, you know, connect things, colors, play with that. It's all totally, it's gonna be part of the Super Mario world. Okay. 
let's start with that's the introduction as always long because i want to also kind of share with you how things came to my brain and well all this it was classic music for me but plan, find out maybe you it's you know uh, helps you to your um focusing and creativity classic music maybe just instrumental music about your favorite type of music rock punk metal so you decide okay i know i'm like ah oh, excited to share this okay where to start you want to start to the easy part it's gonna be the pipe so we're gonna leave it i think that to the end let's start with the hard thing yeah i'd say hard because after all the whole thing is this inflate two balloons quick links these are uh what is um six inch or seven inch rounds the quick links the smallest size okay so this is the quick link or link or loon or linking depending the brand i'm using i think uh decomex so it's up to you which brand but inflate it all the way and close it close to the nasal so what is this uh it's like bigger than the bone with your hands so, okay let's do this when i say close to the nasal why because this is one of the tricks you squish this up pilp, and then you're gonna make like a three finger bubble pinch twist three or two huh it kind of pinch twist and lock them yep lock them you have this what else grab the other one and do the same squish close to the nasal and make like three finger bubble pinch twist things doesn't have to be perfect of course not try do your best have fun this can be a challenge if you're just starting don't give up just watch this video it's going to open your mind uh about all the different techniques you can make with balloons it's not just basic things it can be also more elaborated using round balloons Again, if you don't have quick link, racing bean, create a racing bean that I'm showing you as the video number one in this channel because it's like a cool technique. And so you just do a racing bean and you just have a kind of like a balloon scrap connected here. Okay, you have it. Are we same page? Awesome. Let's see. You have two. Perfect. Grab these two together, the pinch twist and connect it together. Twist. And twist, 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 twist. One pinch twist one side, the other one the other side. Look at this. Every time you make something cool, think about all the things you can make. It can be a fishy, a big fishy. <laughs> it can be many things. Many things. So play with that. This is also another way when you connect quick links, have to make lips um, and then part of a mask of a person. That could be cool. Um, so play with that always. Always, you know, like have fun, take a moment see what else can be okay but now let's keep going you will need now your um 160 yep 160 and this is looks like it's a silly this is not a 160 it's a 260 it looks like a 260 because it's a 160 deco makes i don't have 160 qualitex i don't have 160 um serpentex i don't have you know if you would like to collaborate with the channel please send it to me because this thing is sometimes it is really cool to have those skinny skinny balloons i have it in red the 160 and look at the difference this is a 164 uh bet uh, betalate serpentex or qualitex or gemar and this is the 164 decomex the 160 decomex is always a little bit wider and that's kind of a cool thing in one moment and another good thing in other moments so that's what it is in my end, you don't have 160. Just grab your 260, a squish and a stretch. That's gonna help your balloon to be skinnier and it's gonna look closer to a 160. Okay, now we are here, yes. So this is what you need to do. And and, and it's kind of like the, the technique of the day. Like approximately four or five finger long, twist, 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 twist. Make like a two finger bubble. Twist, 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 twist many times because that's gonna be a pinch twist in a moment. Then make like a, another four or five finger lock and twist it together. Yep. Now you have that. Lock them. And repeat the same thing. One or four finger bubble. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Then two finger bubble approximately. Twist, twist, twist. Because we're going to make a pinch twist in a moment for that one. And squish and go back with a four or five finger lock. Okay. And twist, 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 twist. Lock things, twist, and this is the moment that. Okay, I know. What how long can it say? I don't know. I hope not because I'm Thursday, so today, well, doesn't matter for you because I'm deciding now to make my videos 
kind of giving you these awesome videos and losses. <laughs> so that way I can rest on days because it's good, you know, it's good. I need time also for do other things. So I'm gonna try to kind of like succeed and go crazy and send share videos with you like twice a week or once a week. Yes. That way you will have, you know, constant, but also it's going to give you time for you to watch the videos because I wish more, you know, views can my videos have. And if there is almost 10,000 subscribers and sometimes I see a hundred views, that means it's not enough, right? So maybe you will need more time. So I'm going to give you the time and let's see what happens. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. <laughs> you have this. What to do here? This is a technique. So pay attention. Uh, you can start making a pinch twist into these parts here if you want. It can get untwist, but it's okay. The whites just make a pinch twist in each side and kind of accommodate this. You want it right there, right? That's kind of the idea. You don't want it all the way down. You want this space to be no with the white. So something like this. Now, that's when the quicklings are like magic. You're going to pull and pass all this, locking this white right there and then pass it through the pinch twist from the quick link. Okay, it sounds interesting, and I should, I tie my hair, I should, but this is gonna be, I'm explaining you because when I'm doing it, you will say like, what's gonna, what happened? Because I'm like fighting with the balloon, okay? So you put it here, <laughs> hair, I should tie it, sorry guys. So yes, you, I'm gonna show you how you want this to look. Not all the way down, just right there, and then from there, you're gonna pull as hard as you can. Pull and try to lock them with the white, with the pinch twist, and then go down in the middle of those bubbles of the, and then attach it round around that pinch twist. We made one. We need to do the same with the other side. So again, I'm gonna go and fight with this. Pull as hard as you can pass it around the pinch twist and then go all the way down pulling hard and all the way down to the pinch twist okay and then twist and twist and twist and lock things now it's gonna be something like this i'm gonna show you how things are looking so far Interesting, right? Interesting. Okay. Look. My hands are shaking. Anyways, we are here and we still have this connected there. We're gonna squish because you don't want that too tight, but you wanna also help with the shape. Oh my hair. Okay, peep you. Now let's pass it around. Look around. One side, twist. You can, if you want, make a little pinch twist. It's optional, you don't have to. So I'm not gonna do it, okay? And then you're just gonna go up, squeeze, stretch, and pass it around. Now, when you go back to this place, you can now close these things. How to close that? Look, I'm keeping it there. With this part, you're gonna lose the air, okay? Lose the air, you should Scissors, hamburger, but be careful because you don't want everything to lose it. So you just pass it up around like this. I'm gonna show you. This can get and twist, it's okay. It can, it's, it can be like, wait, the ceiling is breaking. It's like, ah, it's okay, don't worry. You're gonna fix things, but now with the rest, you can always go pull down and keep and help, you know, the force and lock all those little things. Now, this one came undone. Don't worry. You're gonna grab it again. If one of your quick links came undone, don't worry. You're gonna pull again, pass through and connect it as hard as you can to this part. Okay. There you go. You can tie it with uh, the quick with uh, one thing, but it's gonna be the forces of bubbles is gonna help. Okay? So you, the forces of the balloon is stretching and passing around is gonna help to stay there. 
Now, if you have crazy hair like mine and you sit there, take it out. <laughs> yeah, you have something like this. Now, oh, you can see this part. It's going to be hiding in a moment. So it's going to be hiding. Don't worry. It's not a big deal. Now, what to do here? Well, um, you want this. And this is the thing. I was thinking, okay, that's it. It's looking cool. But... If you add a 160 red, it's going to help. So now this is the moment to use the 160 red. Inflated, doesn't really matter, six finger tail. And this time, yes, I'm using a pinch twist, okay? I'm using a pinch twist, like two finger bubble pinch twist, because it's going to help me to hide, hide details from the white, okay? And emptiness. So make your pinch twist, a squish, a stretch, a soft and a squishable. And you're going to attach it right here, okay, and do the same idea. Just pass this around. This time you want also the pinch twist to be in the other side. If you want, if it's not, you just make it into a bubble uh, or just twist. But I'm going to make another pinch twist there just to help me hide details. And then we squish, stretch, and pass around. I'm not pulling that much because the pulling part is going to be the moment that when you close it here, look how I'm using my chest. I'm using my body um to kind of hold bubbles you know and then with the rest you just lose the air okay, you, you, okay let's go nice and bam okay and with all this you're gonna pass this first all the way to this side and pass it to the bubble and then go down and pass it to this pinch twist and uh, look this is the best uh I like it. You're gonna go up, pull around, pass it. And the thing is, that is per, um, helping you to keep the bubbles away. You know, you think it's looking better. Okay? There you go. I'm gonna show you. Now is the moment for you to choose your best angle, your best side. You decide. Um, because it's always one side that you will say, well, I like that side. So that's cool. Okay, so there you go. You have something like this. I like this way. So that's what it is. Now, from here, I want these lips, that is kind of the lips, to be more out. So I'm going to start hiding a 160 a little bit. I'm pulling a little bit more this, um, this, what is, lips uh, with the white. So that's kind of what I'm doing. So you can always play, but it doesn't really matter if you don't want to go too, pro, uh, what is, uh, what is the word? You don't want to go too, um, specific, come, uh, perfectionist, it's totally fine. But I want this white to be a little bit out, a little bit more out. So if you have a 216, maybe it's going to be better. You have something like this. What else from here? Teeth. And for that, it's just a balloon scrap, yellow 160. Uh, you can make it white, but if it's already the rest white, yellow, I think it's a good color. It's there for what is the, you know, the, the real character. So now you have this. What else? Make a bubble, another bubble, and that's kind of like you're going to cut you a little bit of scrap there, but to, to tie it. So you have like one, one finger bubble, one finger, finger bubble, you know, split it in half like this. Okay, now repeat one more time, the same idea or as close as you can. Now, I recommend you one thing, what, what, what? Cut all these little excess to have this design more wow, more wow, more cool, okay, more chatty. Okay, you have it there, and do the same this way. Boom, 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 boom. There, now it's split in half, and you know those pinch twists right here from the white? That is going to be around those pinch twists. Yep. And you twist it and then twist it this way to leave it like this. So then they see two teeth. One side and two teeth the other side. Split in half. Choo, 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 and repeat. Okay. I think this is a very cool design. I can't wait to see if you, uh, this is a, one of those designs that of course, take your time. It's not like, 
Okay, you wanna make this line twisting. There's other ways to make this much faster probably, but sometimes it's cool to have something really awesome that people is gonna be like, wow, you clients are gonna feel like, wow. Oh, wow. <laughs> this is awesome. We did the hardest part. Pretty much, good job, you did it. We are here. Let's now move to the stem. And the thing is, better to 60. Ah, find it right here. And uh, this is my darkest screen. It's an uh, emerald, 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 you know, jewel, see-through. So uh, it can be any dark green, okay? Attach it if you want right now, or first make this, the four finger bubble. Inflate it, five finger down. Okay, uh, four finger bubble, then make a three finger loop, twist, 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 another three finger loop, twist, 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 twist. Okay. And you can make pinch, twist, pinch, twist, but why? No, it's not necessary right now because I want also to end the video not too long. <laughs> now from here you can make more because this flower is like coming out, but they're in his time. So you can make it that it already came out with more leaves that's what i'm gonna do so i'm gonna make sure two finger bubble or three and again three finger bubble and then three finger bubble loop three finger size loop or channel and you have more it's coming out and then here just another three or two finger bubble twist cut the excess with your scissors with your color or with this awesome technique that is just make a bubble at the end and with your nails do that Okay, like snap with your nail, peel, and that's it. You have this and with a tip. Okay, now uh, we're gonna go the easiest part, that pipe. And it's cool, it's cool if you make the pipe because you can just make it, just the stamp, that's it, and then where it'll be up. But with this, it's gonna act a little better. And you just need two balloons, 350 lime green, okay? Inflate it five finger towel and let's measure one two three three and then go back so it's like approximately what four plus three twelve finger long and then go back with twelve finger long and then go another one twelve finger long twist it you can go uh, again with another twelve finger long that means we're gonna need more air so or yeah we're gonna need more air yeah so I'm gonna um, leave it, when you do this, inflate it actually, mm, three finger tail, or leaving just two finger tail, because it's really, you just need more. Okay, so go, and you can end up with a bubble, it's totally fine. You may finish there with a the bubble, totally cool. You know why? Because that bubble can be a pinch twist. So, yes, now you have this. Grab your second balloon 350, inflated three finger tail. Okay, but so you have enough. And then don't pull your hair, just attach it to the pinch twist. And boom, and you're gonna make two or what is or two more pinch twists or one more pinch twist you decide like two finger bubble pinch twist and another two finger bubble pinch twist it's up to you but i'm gonna make two more so this time it's gonna be three pinch twists it's again optional with the rest you cut but don't get rid of this don't get rid of this just a squish tie because with this you're gonna also use it just make one finger bubble pinch twist another one finger bubble pinch twist and this is gonna go around in a moment. In a moment, so switch, stretch. You will need this to the end. So make sure this part is around. So then it's all not open at this and attach this part uh -huh. there. Okay. There we go. Now you have this. Uh, remember always, you can avoid details, doesn't have to be exactly. If you want to leave it simple, you can just leave it like this. If you want something more elaborated, you can always make something more elaborated, okay? You decide. But I'm going to leave it for a moment like this, and then you're going to grab this, and then put it, the pinch twist in the back, and then just going to go around. Yes, that's what it's going to be, around the pinch twist. A little bit of pressure and make it 
and look like the pipe. That's the idea. Uh, if it's coming out, it's okay. For me, um, one of the things is harder is to work with um, balloons, three feet, you know, bigger sizes. Some people, you know, uh, love and they are really good working with big balloons. For me, it's a little bit more tricky. And it's not like I'm not a small person, but it's it's harder. So uh, just attach it to those pinch please again. And there you go. Find what is your favorite front. So in my case, it's the one I'm showing you right now. And this is how it's gonna be looking, okay? Then it's time just to um let me see, it's time to attach the flower so with this stick you're gonna just attach it to those pinch twists okay okay the design is almost ready you can always twist this around so to make it more um, stable but the design is pretty much ready uh, find your perfect um front and that's the one you're gonna be using so in my case seems like it's gonna be this one, this design really is going to have both sides really looking really good. So it's not going to be that hard. But um, this is how it's going to be looking. Ah! Oh no! Almost! <laughs> okay, so now it's sticker time. Or level, because it's not going to be shopping time, it's going to be a sticker. So you're just going to grab your sticker. And really, it's like approximately three in each side. And different, you know, positions. It's gonna be fine. So that's what it for me. If you don't have this, look, you can grab white Sharpie. If you don't have white Sharpie, always black circle, uh, just the silhouette is gonna be, okay, whatever. So just put it in any position, really. Something like this. And then the other side, different side, different uh, position is gonna be okay. Let me take this out first, because yeah. So that's kind of pretty much, guys. I hope you like it. A long video, craziness is still there, yeah, man. But that's what it is. This is a tutorial, and I really want to share with you all details as much as I can. I think um, you can learn a lot by just trying or watching the videos because sometimes it's uh, maybe you think this is too advanced. Maybe um, you can also consider it a challenge. Why not try it? I think it's a very cool design. I love it. Um, look, and it's really, really, really awesome to have this and share it, you know, on a birthday party or if it's already someone that is a fan of uh, this cool, uh, this, uh, people, uh, what is the Mario, the Mario world, right? Yeah, I love it. So I hope you can enjoy it. Don't forget, like, comment, subscribe, and very important on the description of all my videos you always will find their ideas how to collaborate with this channel because this channel doesn't have really sponsors the sponsors are you all of you watching my videos liking it subscribing and commenting and donating money or balloons it's you know you are a sponsor in this channel that totally motivates me every time you know you are able to to donate because it's you know that's the magic about this channel already four years you know making videos for all of you and i i am very very grateful thank you so much don't forget what else try to do it and tag me on instagram or any social media as alpaca globo okie dokie now these things are really cool um and i hope these videos can help but again the best way how to learn from someone it's be in person and in person, I'm already confirming, I'm gonna be at Las Vegas Bling Bling Jam. It's a balloon convention, really awesome balloon convention, and I'm gonna be there. So all the designs that you are watching in this YouTube channel, if you feel like, how can, I wish, you know, Cecilia can explain it again or, or explain me better this part, I will be happy to be with you because the cool thing about the balloon conventions, we have everyday jams jam session that i'm gonna be there for all the jam sessions and there the whole convention because it's a really cool you know four days full of twisting and learning and experience you know the magic of one thing be with other balloon twisters and feel that energy that cool part about sharing you know and and as soon as you're there everybody's open to share as much as they can so that's the beautiful part about this balloon convention and people is super friendly and 
and very, very nice, you know. So I hope you can make it. The, all the information is there, the blimblingjam.com. Uh, so yeah, you can always, you know, like start registering because if you register it soon, it's cheaper. And then as soon as you're getting closer, the price is gonna be a little bit higher, but it's a really cool deal. Again, four days full of different, you know, teachers, instructors be there sharing a lot of new things, you know, the new things in the balloon world and also the old tricks and old things that, you know, it's always good to know. So, okie dokie, I'm leaving now. Bye bye, enjoy this tutorial. I love it. It's one of my favorites, you know, because <laughs> it's so cool. <laughs> Look at this shirt. Okay, don't get distracted. Bye bye.